Scleroderma literally means hard skin. It's an autoimmune disease that affects multiple organ systems. It's characterized by thickening or fibrosis of the skin and other organs as well. They can get uh, fibrosis or scarring in their lungs, and that's called interstitial lung disease. Uh, they can also get what we call pulmonary hypertension, and that's a condition uh, where the, the pressure in the blood vessel that connects the heart to the lungs is high. Uh, and things like interstitial lung disease and pulmonary hypertension can cause patients to have symptoms of breathlessness. Because there currently are no FDA-approved therapies for scleroderma, I, I think it's really important that patients seriously consider participating in clinical trials for scleroderma. Here at Columbia, we're a site for several uh, multi-center clinical trials looking at um, various medications. So I think right now there are many more options for the treatment of scleroderma than there ever were before. As program director of the CUMC NYP scleroderma program, I serve as the site principal investigator for the scleroderma clinical trials here at Columbia. I also coordinate the care of patients with scleroderma who are seen here at Columbia. Because Columbia is an academic medical center, our patients with scleroderma have access to the very best specialists. It's really important to find a rheumatologist who you're comfortable with. It's really important to find a rheumatologist who you trust.